shore to see some orcas. We're gonna go to Orcas Island and kind of all the fjords northwest of Seattle. Um, I think it's called the San Juan Islands. Um, our buddy Sean did a tour and recommended it. So Bree and I just found something online and we booked it. We're not sure what it's gonna be like with COVID and everything going on, but probably just gonna be masked up. Um, but apparently they guarantee that we'll see orca whales. So it should be pretty sick. So we're just getting ready and Bree's making some food. Yeah, butter and jelly. So we just grabbed some coffee from Starbucks and we're just getting a few last minute things ready. We are gonna be on the water. It looks like we booked the boat that has an inside and an outside. Um, but yeah, we're gonna be on the water. Bree, check the weather. It's gonna be in the 60s, probably with a lot of wind. So we got jackets, hoodies, and all that stuff because it's probably gonna be cool. But we are on our way. And if you're doing this tour, you can have an option for parking included for $10. So we did that just so we don't need to be rushing around looking for parking. So check in right here is at 459 Admiral Way. So super easy and smooth. We got here a few minutes early. So we're just gonna kick it and then board in a few minutes. Sound. Puget. 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 Just Puget. Puget. Puget sound. <laughs> So I just got out of the wind tunnel on the back of the boat and I got some really cool macro shots of the water. It just looks so crazy. We're going so fast that the waves are incredible. But sadly, no whales yet. No whales yet. So the mountains over here on the west at 10 o'clock, the captain just said the Olympic Mountains. We were wondering, but they're super cool looking. And then on the east, I think it's the Cascade Range, but it's where Mount Rainier, uh, North Cascades Park, and all that stuff is. So surrounded in mountains in every direction, which is sick.
guys, so all in all, we are super happy we did this tour. Um, we opted to go on the non-adventure boat since it wasn't outside the whole time and I'm extremely glad because it was freezing the whole time. So uh, <laughs> it was awesome and we saw wheels. So all in all, that was an amazing day tour. It was, I think, 320-ish dollars for both of us. That included parking, um, unlimited coffee or cider, which was pretty awesome. Day tour, it was very educational. It was very beautiful. You had to see all of the fjords, um, the mountains. You got to see Mount Baker, Mount Rainier, and we saw tons and tons of whales. I was shooting on the 85 millimeter APS-C. My photos kind of suck. Bree had the 7200 uh, with a teleconverter and APS-C. She was able to get pretty good photos, but honestly, unless you have like 300 millimeter lens or more, I wouldn't, I mean, bring the camera, but I would recommend kind of just enjoying it. Um, you know, you're probably not gonna get the best photos unless you have a really good telephoto lens. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Catch you guys later. Bye.